Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy, and today's quick tip is an Adobe Audition CC 2020. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use amplitude statistics to measure the amplitude or the loudness of your audio files in Adobe Audition. So here we are in the waveform view of Adobe Audition. To open amplitude statistics, go up to the window menu and select amplitude statistics. You want to be on general and to measure the amplitude or the loudness of this audio file, all you have to do is click on the scan button. If you just want to scan a selection, you can just select it then click on scan selection and it will only measure the amplitude for that one selection. I'm going to deselect all, click on scan so it'll measure the entire audio file. A couple things that you might look at in the amplitude statistics. The first is peak amplitude. This is going to tell you what the loudest peak is. So what the highest point of your audio file is at. In this case, it's minus 6.23. If you ever want to see where the peak amplitude is in your audio file or one of these other measurements, just click on this little marker and that will move the current time indicator to that location in your audio file. I like to record my audio somewhere between minus 6 and minus 12 dB, so I hit that range. Another one you might look at is right here, possibly clipped samples. You always want this at zero. That tells me that there's nothing clipping or there's nothing going in the red or over zero. And finally, at the very bottom, you will see the ITU loudness measurement. This is great. If you ever just want to see if your audio file meets the broadcast or the podcast loudness standards, you can go into amplitude statistics, do a scan, look at the very bottom to see where you're at. So this is a mono file. And if you look up here, it'll say channel one. If you run the amplitude statistics on a stereo file, I'll just double click on the stereo file, go to amplitude and statistics, click on scan, you will see you get the measurement for the left and the right channels. So if you make any changes or adjustments to your audio file, I'll select this, I'm just going to crank the volume way up, you will see this exclamation mark next to the scan selection. That is telling you that the source media has changed. You need to rescan the selection in order to update the amplitude statistics. So go ahead and click on scan selection again. You'll see the peak amplitude is at 4.75. That is bad. We're above zero. And if you look at the possibly clipped samples, there are 722. Remember, we want this at zero. I'm just going to undo that. You'll see the exclamation mark again. I'll click on scan selection. It's going to reanalyze it. And now you can see we're back under zero. We have no clip samples, which is where we want to be. My name is Mike Murphy, and that is how you use amplitude statistics in Adobe Audition CC 2020. Cheers.